in the States, large, by and large, positive feedback. Same thing it seems in the yeah. UK for people not named Kathy Newman. But Canada still, uh, a lot of people there hate you. What's interesting to me is this is effectively a self-help book. I can't remember in my lifetime, I'm, I'm sure someone will fact check me here, I'm sure I, I, it's happened, but certainly not to this degree, that a self-help book has been met with so much backlash. Uh, why, why do you think that is? Because ultimately what you are doing as someone who's, who's gone through the self-authoring program, you are looking to help people. That's your goal. Well, you know, I, I took a stand against the radical leftists that started about, it's almost 18 months ago now. And if you take a stand against the radical leftists, then they immediately try to paint you as a supervillain of the right. And so that's just continuing in Canada. Uh, not with everyone. I mean, I have many journalists who are supporting what I'm doing in Canada, sure. but it's definitely polarized. And like there was an article in Canada's so-called national newspaper, the Globe and Mail this week, which by the way is failing dismally as it moves forward through time, that really was a hit piece. And, and it's an attempt by the people I would say on the radical left or people who are just misinformed to tar everyone who dares to stand up to their hypocritical and racist idiocy um, by making the case that they're associated with like far right thinking, which mm -hmm. is just preposterous. It's First of all, you don't you don't have to be far right to dislike the radical left. You just have to be sensible and reasonable and not full to the brim with resentment and false. What do you call that? False compassion. So the yeah. problem is, is if the radical left admits that someone like me actually happens to be reasonable, then they have to admit that reasonable people can object to what they're doing. And then if reasonable people can object to it, then there's always the possibility that there's something wrong with it. Imagine that, something wrong with identity politics and identifying people by race and ethnicity and, and construing the world as victim and victimizer. I would, re imagine I would reduce that and just wrong. say, imagine something being wrong. 